Hello everyone, welcome to the Mathematics MI channel. Today I came up with another interesting integral. Integral from 0 to 1 natural log of 1 minus x to the k dx is equal to the answer is uh, minus di gamma of 1 over k plus k plus gamma here gamma we know oil as mascaroni constant. So let's begin with uh, the use substitution here we have x to the k. So I am going to take x to the k is equal to t then we should differentiate so dt is equal to k times x to the uh, k minus 1 dx. Now we can isolate the dx so dx is equal to 1 over k uh, times x to the 1 minus k dt. Now here we have x to the 1 minus k but we know x is equal to x is equal to t to the 1 over k t to the 1 over k. So here we can write dx is equal to 1 over k. Now here x we know t to the uh, 1 over k. So the power is 1 over k times 1 minus k. So 1 over k minus 1 dt. Now we can plug into our integral. So here uh, now we know limit also 0 to 1 natural log of 1 minus x to the k we know t and dx we know 1 over k times t to the 1 over k minus 1 dt. Now k is a constant so we can take outside of the integral sign so 1 over k integral from 0 to 1. Now here we have natural log of 1 minus t times t to the 1 over k minus 1 dt. Okay, then uh, here we have a natural log of 1 minus t. So, we can use uh, the series representation of data series representation of natural log of 1 minus t. Uh, natural log of 1 minus x is equal to minus infinite sum n is equal 1 to infinity x to the n over n. So, we can write uh, here now minus 1 over k integral from 0 to 1 infinite sum n is equal 1 to infinity. Now, here we have t uh, here x. So, instead of x now uh, we should plug in t. So, here we have t to the n over n times t to the 1 over k minus 1 dt. Okay, then we can switch the uh, sigma notation and integral sign. So, we can write uh, here minus 1 over k infinite sum n is equal 1 to infinity uh, 1 over n integral from 0 to 1. Now, here we have t to the n here t to the 1 over k minus 1. So, we can simplify t to the n plus 1 over k minus 1 t t. Okay, then we can integrate uh, by using uh, general power rule of integration. So, here n is equal 1 to infinity 1 over n times now here t to the n plus 1 over k over n plus 1 over k uh, limit from 0 to 1. Okay, now if we apply limit, uh, we have minus 1 over k infinite sum n is equal 1 to infinity 1 over n. Uh, now, here we have 1 over n plus 1 over k. Okay, then uh, I am going to multiply by k. So, uh, here minus n is equal 1 to infinity 1 over n uh, times now here we have 1 over uh, n times k plus uh, 1 over k times k we know 1 plus n times k okay then uh, we can simplify uh, here minus n is equal 1 to infinity now here we can write uh, 1 over n minus 
k over 1 plus n k okay then uh, we can multiply by with uh, minus sign so we can write uh, n is equal 1 to infinity k over 1 plus n k minus 1 over n okay how to evaluate this infinite uh, series well uh, we can um, we can recall the uh, digamma function digamma of x digamma of x is equal to minus gamma minus 1 over x plus infinite sum n is equal 1 to infinity 1 over n minus 1 over x plus n uh, we prove this identity in uh, digamma function video uh, if you like uh, to watch that video i will add the link in the description and also make a card uh, so, uh, then as the next step, I am going to multiply by both sides, I am going to multiply by minus sign at the same time, uh, instead of x, I am going to plug in 1 over x. So, here uh, minus di gamma of 1 over x is equal to, now if you multiply by minus sign, here we know uh, plus gamma plus, now instead of x 1 over x, so x. Uh, then here again I am going to take uh, plus n is equal 1 to infinity. Now we should multiply by minus sign. So here uh, we have 1 over uh, n plus 1 over x minus 1 over n. Now uh, here minus di gamma of 1 over x is equal to gamma plus x plus uh, here we have infinite sum n is equal 1 to infinity now here if we take common denominator we know uh, 1 plus n x here x minus 1 over n now we know uh, this is our series and this is equal to this series uh, but instead of x now we have k so we can write uh, here minus di gamma of 1 over x so minus uh, di gamma of 1 over instead of x now we have k then here uh, x x we know here k so uh, minus so we take minus sign as a common factor so plus k and here gamma so plus gamma okay this is the answer if you like this type of videos please subscribe this channel thank you for watching